So Tyler Perry, you hear me now? If you want to hire me, I'm available. Welcome back to my channel guys. This video is an educational video. One of my subscribers asked me to do a book on the books I've written. I'm an author and I've published so far three books and she asked me to do a video on those books. Now because those books, if I talk about three of them in this one video, it can be a little lengthy. So I decided that I was going to feature one book per week so this week I'm gonna do one of the books the other week and then the other week so welcome okay the first book I've written is a book of poems and the title of it is called life experiences this is the cover right here so you guys can see it it's the front cover the back cover okay now this book I published in 2012 so that was how many years ago do we know our map it's 2018 that was about six years ago yeah six years ago I published my first book and like I said, it's a book of poems and this this particular book was dedicated to my sister on the passing of my sister, my other sister, who died tragically. So I dedicated the poems in the book to her. It's called Life Experiences for a Reason. She died at a very young age. She died at 19 years old while she was in college studying to become a teacher like myself. And she was tragically killed. So I don't want to get into the details of her death because the book is this video is more about the book I just put that plug in there because it's actually dedicated to her so I wrote the poems between the ages of 13 and in my early in my late 20s all of the poems were compiled between those those ages the illustrator for the book is an art teacher his name is Dana Burroughs. He's a very talented young artist. And I just told him that, told him the, the, what I envisioned for the book and what the book was all about. And he came up with this drawing. I guess it can be viewed as a man or a woman. It's unisex, it's a unisex image. And I guess the person is experiencing life or evolving and growing. So it was something that my sister wasn't able to do. And because she wasn't able to do that, I am now sharing my life experiences with her, even though she cannot see or hear. It's just something for me to do to give back to her and to show her that I appreciate her and I love her. And her life was, yeah, very important to me. And of course, the other persons who knew her as well. So this is the book here. It's called Life Experiences. It's a compilation of poems based on basically everything that uh, that she has not or haven't had the experience to the years to experience based on her untimely death so there's poems based on life and death poems about the bohemian culture because I'm a bohemian she's a bohemian we have miscellaneous poems poems about love and relationships it's all about things that she has not or wasn't given the opportunity to experience because of her untimely death now I wanted to read I want to be a long video but I wanted to read one of the poems in the book I should do one in and one in every category oh there's also one in Korea I don't have any poems in the Korea category though okay I think I should read so many questions that's the, actually the first poem in the book this is a dedication page that is me and her right there when we were younger. 
and this book is available on amazon.com yes it is i'm going to give you some facts so you can know what to do if you want to purchase the kindle version it's for 3.99 that's so cheap eh? kindles are the electronic box where you could always have them when you want the hardcover i'm not sure whether they say the hardcover is 309 because that obviously is wrong but that's what um amazon is saying right now but we can't see it and paperback is 15.99 so it's available on amazon and this book is linked it is always linked in my channel so you can go below in my channel and you will see this book and you can purchase it on amazon okay which poem should i read to you guys i'm very dramatic guys so i do dramatic readings i'm an actress so tyler perry you hear me now if you want to hire me i'm available will smith i am available i'm not kidding guys i'm serious but anyway i'll read the poem called so many questions this one is really heartfelt So many questions. The dreadful cries for help were too far to reach, even though it seemed so close. The pain and agony that will forever haunt me. Could I have done better or was this meant to be? Was this a lesson to be taught or could something this cruel ever be demonstrated as a lesson? One question remained in my head though. Why? Why so young, so green to the world? This shouldn't be the age that somebody goes. For 17 long years, I've known you. And two years and nine months, I didn't. And all this still couldn't bring back the joy of you not being here. You were so beautiful, so delicate to the touch. Now, what is there to see? What is there to feel? Not much. Oh, the hurt I experience just staring at your beautiful remains. It brings tears to my eyes and a heart filled with pain. If this is God's master plan, why don't I understand? Or should I understand why even innocent people must leave us sometimes? People don't seem to understand the pain I'm going through. They don't seem to realize how close we were. Even until the end, it was just me and you. Every day I think, would things have turned out differently if you didn't leave? Because you left us so young, was that the correction of an error? Would your life ever amount to anything if you were to stay just a little while longer? Could this mishap have happened to make mommy become stronger? I don't know what else to think. So many questions plague my mind. Why didn't you give us a sign that you were going? Or didn't you know until the master held out his hand? Why do I feel this way? Like I've been cheering on in a championship championship game. Will I ever hear you say the Carrier Brown again? That powerful dynamic name? I hope you are sleeping comfortably in the garden that you temporarily rest. I know things will work out for the better because God only takes his best. And that's so many questions that's the first poem in here and of course like you can hear the message it's dedicated to my sister who passed at the age of 19 while she was in college and I was she was 19 I was 16 so when she was in college I was in the 12th grade my last year of high school so I'm like about she was like about two year two years and nine months older than I am so yes that's one of the poems in the book um there's another poem that I really like this one is I'll go on for miscellaneous it's called testimony it's on page 46 but you guys can see what page I'm on you would if you buy the book this one is <clears throat> has a little rhythm so you gotta be a little you know has a little rap to it. <clears throat> Let's see if I can get my rap game on. It's called Testimony. 
I don't want to be deep in sleep when God take a leap on my bedside for a ride on the pearly gates of heaven. Cause God knows I would cry and die, perish twice, I'm not fly in the sky. Why did I lie in bed with that man when he tried to lose my button? Now look at me, a glutton, and for what? Nothing? Sex isn't so great, you can't wait, love, using faith, love, not hate for your body, now you late? No mistake, it's the risk you take and decisions you make. So try again and think smart with your mind, not your heart, because you can't fall apart ending up where you start. Life's too short to abort what you thought would never happen. Girls, love yourselves. Life's a test. Want the best. Tell them you're a gem in a chest to be sought after. Not some hike or ride to be used or abused, neglected or refused. I'm too good for that man with a pan in his hand who hit me. So I'm leaving my dignity and my pride to take that ride God offered me in the beginning. And that's testimony. So guys, as you can see, my book is filled with poems. I love poetry. It's all about poetry. It's all about poetic expression and imaginative writing. I'm a language arts teacher. So of course I get in that groove. You know, anyway, let me calm down. But like I said again, this is my book. This video is dedicated to my book. It's called Life Experiences by Benik and Julia Brown. And if you want to buy it, like I said, it's available on Amazon. The direct link is in the description box below. But that's it for this video, guys. If you have any questions on my book or my poems, leave them in the comment section below and I will be sure I answer all your questions. I comment at every single person. I only got 500 some subscribers. And most of y'all don't comment anyway. So, comment below. Let me know what you think about my poems. And if you want to author yourself, link your book below. That will be interesting. I can feature your book when I finish featuring my books. But that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching my channel, watching my video. Make sure you press that subscribe button because we are almost to 600 subscribers. By the time this video goes up, we will have already surpassed 600 subscribers. So give this video a like, comment below, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you guys always. Mwah. Did we do a thumbnail? If we didn't, here it goes.